What's up guys? Devil Doll Gamer here and we are back playing some Stormworks and there's been some pretty cool things that I've found and yes the frame rate is a little low that's because we're on something very large and very awesome that I think you guys really like and that is a ballistic missile submarine. Ha 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 ha. There are no weapons at Stormworks but people have figured out how to make things like this. So we're gonna go below deck, slow her down, and launch her. So, current depth, speed, how about we just throttle back a little bit, okay? How about we just zero it out? Okay. And we'll give it a shot. Um, here's the mess, the mess area where, you know, all the people, not the mess area, people live. You got your showers. People make some of the coolest shit in this game. This is why I love it. There's just amazing stuff. Um, white is the sea current depth. Red's the seafloor, 80, 80 feet is the depth. This is also the ballast system, ballast control, circuit breakers, map, periscope, what's all this? Oh, red light. Oh. Oh cool, we put up our sonar and radar mast, legit. Okay, so let's kind of give more of a tour. Here's the missile tubes. <laughs> and that sound is the sound. Well, here's the laundry room. This is the nuclear reactor. Reactor output, batteries are good. We can actually probably lower the power because our batteries are pretty good. We'll keep the coolant off, system power off. So we can turn off the reactor. Our batteries are filled. And then over here is the weapons room. And then we have the torpedo room. And if you actually open it up, you can see the torpedoes that are in there. You can reload them, but I don't know where the reloads come from, per se. So, first things first, we are going to go to the missile battery. So, a few things we can do here. One of them being, we can target something. Uh, let's target here with a GPS coordinate waypoint. So, if we go into here, let's take the GPS onto our current waypoint. Awesome. We'll go ahead and open the missile hatch, arm the missile. Tube 1 is now ready. And hopefully this works. Fire! Sometimes it doesn't. Oh. There it goes. Wiggle, wiggle! Let's see if we can actually see it go. <laughs> oh, there it is! I see it in the cloud. Wow, that thing's fast. And it's dropping. You can barely see it. Of course, there's no nukes, no explosions, but... It still shows that people can make these things. People make the greatest shit ever. Alright. Let's see if we can GPS coordinate... Strike... No. Our position, maybe. Is that position here? They might have trouble because of the, how close it is. Yeah, it's too close. Oh shit, open the missile hatch. Yeah, it's gonna bug out because it's too close. Alright, so let's do torpedoes. Set depth below target surface. We can do GPS, or we can do the current bearing. Distance to target. Let's go ahead and prime the torpedo for lunch. And as you can see, none of the doors are open. And then open the outer door. There it goes. And launch the torpedo. It'll take it a hot second to come out, because... It's not really smooth, but it will come out. Eventually. <laughs> One day. <laughs> oh, what's all this? Maybe if I make us go backwards? I like how we have all these random weapons stuck at the moment. Oh, 
Yeah, it didn't come out. Oh no, it's gone. We launched her. I have no idea where she went. Oh, there it is. I see it moving. Okay, we need to stop her. Yeah, this the sub. Good proof concept. Pretty cool. It's definitely awesome, but there are helicopters with torpedoes. We might actually leave the sub right on out here. Alright, as you can see, we have a Seahawk that has freaking hellfires that I don't know if work. A fuel tank. It's actually full up on fuel at the moment. And the same GPS torpedo as the last, as the uh, actual... Um, sub that we just tried so we're gonna hop in on the pilots that's a co-pilot seat maybe i'll just hop on over to the pilot seat okay cool um i'm gonna put us into so i can do it with my joystick and stuff axis switch controls release drop tank hold pitch auto hover gear brake lock drop tank backlight so there's somebody else that handles the torpedo here oh a door gunner oh yep Okay, hold on, let's, uh, yeah, there's another torpedo officer, it looks like. And I think we're going to set it to right there. Set the GPS coordinates. Okay, cool. So we're going to have to, like, quickly get up and launch it. I'll throw it on auto hover. All right, so electrical power, engine start. Gear brake off. That's auto hover at the moment. All right. Okay, and we will lift. I love that you get joystick support with this. It's fucking awesome, dude. Okay, hold on. I kind of want to get this auto hover off for right now. Yeah, let's turn off auto hover right now. There we go. Much better. Now I can get a little more aggressive with my maneuvers. It's gonna be weird to throw it on auto hover and then launch a fucking torpedo. But well, whatever. There's the sub. My current altitude, 60 something meters. We're gonna have to lower that down just a little bit. Not crash into the water. No? Okay. Auto hover. Boop. Let's bring the altitude down just a little bit. And we'll hold altitude at about 20. altitude here. Okay, we're getting out. We're going to prime torpedo, double check GPS coordinate, roger that, and launch. There it goes! Running out of steam already. No, 
Oh, it's about to hit! It hit, but I'm but there's no explosives in game, so it probably did zero damage. Yeah, it's just sitting there next to it. That was a successful hit, though. Hold on. I want to do something. Hold and hold. Let's bring it a little closer forward. Okay. And we're jumping out of the seat. And opens the door. Door gun on. Swing the door gun out! <laughs> That's cool. Okay. Is there a winch that I can use? What's this? Hatch? Oh shit! Oh. Grab it! No! 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 <laughs> oh no! Come on down, winch! <laughs> Son of a bitch. It's like the Hunt for Red October type shit. Yeah, it's not getting any lower. Boo! Alright, since everybody likes crazy stuff, how about an ME163 Comet? Mmm, yes, I'm so ready to run out of fuel <laughs> in two minutes and die. This will be fun. Alright, that's canopy, landing skid, button. I guess we're just gonna straight up launch. Yep. Looks like it. Here we go. Whoa! There go the skids. Holy crap moly. Oh, let me dump my landing skid off. There we go. Holy shit! <laughs> we need to keep her around the airfield, though. So find another airfield to land at. I don't know where we can find how much fuel we have left. Where's our fuel? Oh, we already have a low fuel light. That's fun. Did I grab a parachute before I got into this thing? I know that's kind of like... A must have. Okay, I need my instruments. Morning, low fuel. Woohoo! Nope, no runway there. No runway there either. Not all the fuel in the world. Just keep climbing into space! Hopefully we can find somewhere for her to land before she runs out of fuel. Maybe? Who knows? I 
hear, I'm hearing it start to throttle down. Need to find an island. Um, this one. She's just a glider now. Oh, I'm pretty much diving straight to the ground. <laughs> oh god. Okay, well, let's put out the uh, landing skid. She definitely had a good amount of uh, fuel. Good thing we got altitude to glide her in. Even though this place probably has no runway. I'm starting to see it. Either that or a cloud. Oh, we're getting back into the clouds. Okay, I'm going to try to get her pulled up and then hook her. Dude, it does not want to pull up. Oh, without power, she is just nosediving. Oh no! Oh no! We're just falling like a rock! No! <laughs> no! No! All right, boys. How about a uh, 747? Hmm. This thing is a uh, gigantic, and it's a cargo variant, so of course. It is massive. Um, I'm pretty sure she's gonna be too full of fuel to take off, but we'll give her a shot. Maybe we can dump some fuel. Instrument, cabin, doom, reverse thrust, nice, okay, what's this, fuel cross feed, holy hell, yeah, that's a lot of fuel, fuel pumps, engine, 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 get a little bit of throttle, there's no way, there's no way it's going to take off. It's just too much fuel. Alright, let's see. Okay. Why are we going backwards? We might actually do it, dude. Oh, we're airport! Holy shit! Okay, she is not balanced at all. Ooh! Okay, she is extremely. She needs stick 100% of the time. That's a little bit like what she said. Wow, this thing is just massively difficult to fly. Is that what I think it is right there? Okay, cool. We have an airfield to land on. Okay. 
Airspeed, okay. Speed hold throttle. Wheel brakes will be needed on this. Oh, we're back in a back in a climb. I don't want to stall. Thank you. And now we're in a dive. A bad dive. Okay, can we just stop being so sensitive? I'm just gonna have to like feather her, I think. It has a big delay on when anything's happening. Okay, we can yaw her on in for the landing, I think. go backwards. Wow. Brakes, brakes, brakes. No! Oh my god, we're lifting off backwards. I've, oh my god. Oh Jesus. That's not supposed to happen. No. Pull up. Oh no. She's on fire. Evacuate. Oh god. I <laughs> jumped out the window. <laughs> Run away! Oh, nope, I made it back in. Evacuate! Oh god, there's water. She's flooding. How do we get the back door open? Oh my goodness, the wings are all damaged. Open the nose! Open the nose! Well, boys, these are just some of the things you can do with glorious fucking Stormworks. This game's great, keeps getting better each update. If you haven't played it yet, you need to. It's it's awesome. It's a lot of fun. Anyways, guys, if you want to see some more, then uh, let me know in the comments below. Talk to you guys later. Peace.